Father Ibrahim, any any one message for? Uh, uh, well, I think I have spoken enough. Anything? So, uh, we, we can now. Uh, they are all religious merch. Yeah. Something that is common. Something that is common. I'm talking about. What we discussed. There's a lot of commonality, and Christianity accepts all these things. So love, compassion, and yes. uh, mercy. Thank you. Yeah, sir. In Islam, peace is the summum that is greatest good. There is a verse in the Quran, Asul of Khair. Sufi have adopted their formula from this Quranic verse. Sulikul. Sulikul means peace with all. I think that the peace is the basis of all kind of goodness, like happiness, health everything. Without peace, there is no development. Without peace, there is no progress. Secular and religious both. So Islam laid emphasis, laid great emphasis on peace. Because peace is the sound bonum according to Islamic analysis. Thank you. Uh, peace, peace and peace. And that's what we end up every period with. Shanti, Shanti, Shanti. That's what we do. Uh, pieces, pieces, and pieces. Yes, from peace, don't make it pieces, pieces, and pieces. Let peace remain as peace. Ashokji. I don't represent any religion. Uh, Ashokji says, I don't represent any religion. Anybody who doesn't represent a religion is humanity. And that's what Ashokji is. He, he, he represents the humanity as a religion. The merger of all religions is Ashok Pradanji. No, no. The only thing I wish to say is. That's Bhartiya Vidya Bhavan. The only thing I wish to say, you have already said, Dr. Bhatia, about Bhartiya Vidya Bhavan. The entire aim and exercise of a human mind, if it is fixed on harmony within and harmony without, half of the problems are taken care of. Harmony within and harmony without not taking any religion into consideration will give you health, happiness, non-violence, love, affection and summum bonum of all the religions and the unity of the religions, all the philosophies. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, Ashokji, uh, uh, Raghavanji, would you like to say something? Prayer, prayer, meditation, compassion, and service. These four religions. These four religions. Thank you. Uh, <coughs> Sunilji? Uh, there is, you know, the, uh, what is our main problem? I think Duryodhan uh, expresses to Krishna. He says, Krishna, I know what is right. I know what is dharma. But somehow my pravritti is such that I can't do it. I know what is wrong. I want to avoid it. But my tendencies of the, my mind, my past tendencies force me to do it. So therefore the whole idea uh, when we are trying to talk about health and happiness is to change our worldview, change our mindset, which is a very, very, very difficult task. And it takes uh, not a whole lifetime to change our uh, tamasic tendencies to rajasic tendencies towards sattvic tendencies. Therefore we have to plan a strategy so that at a young age these things are given in a a non-religious method but purely logical and rational so that the students can understand. So what is the healthy worldview of reality? As long as I think I am the body, I am bound to be selfish, self-centered and different from others. Only when I am taught and I start practicing to feel oneness in life will I feel apnapan with others. How do I do that? Worldview of reality has to change from worldview of separation to worldview of oneness. Then uh, uh, the quality of thoughts has to be improved by japa and all these prayers, etc. Quantity of thoughts has to be reduced by leaving a planned life towards the, the priority of the goal of life. Then uh, understanding the idea, where is the, the source of anand? It is within me. How in deep sleep we experience anand without any objects. So the children can understand that happiness has got nothing to do with objects, whereas the whole mind is associated with that. So therefore these four things, then we have to practice a daily simple prayer 
may all beings be happy may all beings be peaceful may all beings be blissful if just simple prayer is taught and practiced then the mind start becoming pure when we think of good of others so thank these are some of these thank you uh, now we have uh, our uh, rohit pagya ji to talk about uh, in one line what is the common message which common message what i understood is that you said that for monday we should practice this thing tuesday no, no, I guess this that thing was just that. i i i what i understood that all demands only one thing that is purification of psych if there is a purification of psych if there is a flow of pure consciousness then will the flow of pure emotions then flow of pure thoughts and automatically there will be the happiness and health in our life and that demands awareness I would just uh, want to say because सब शेर व शायरी करे थे सिर्फ दो लाइन में कहना चाहूँगी अगर अवेयरनेस है तो सब कुछ है जागरूकता होनी जरूरी है अगर जागरूकता है इफ यू हैव अवेयरनेस यू कैन प्योरीफाई योर साइक यू कैन प्योरीफाई योर इमोशंस कुछ लोगों को हंसते हंसते रोते देखा कुछ लोगों को हंसते हंसते रोते देखा कुछ लोग रोने में भी हंसते हैं कुछ लोगों को सोते सोते जगते देखा तो कुछ लोग जगने में भी सोते हैं हंसते और जगते वे ही हैं जिनको जीवन से प्यार है हंसते और जगते वे ही हैं जिनको जीवन से प्यार है रोते और सोते वे ही हैं जिनके लिए जीवन बेकार है तो अगर हमको जीवन से प्यार है जीवन में खुशी चाहिए तो वी शुड बी अवेयर फॉर ईच एंड एवरी मोमेंट एंड ट्राई टू प्योरीफाई अवर साइक ऑटोमेटिकली इमोशंस विल बी प्योरीफाई एंड वी विल हैव हैप्पीनेस एंड हेल्थ इन अवर लाइफ थैंक यू लास्ट वर्ड फ्रॉम दुनिया जी I think the one basic contribution to the stock could be in addition to being a good person you should also have a good sense of humor. Absolutely. Uh, <laughs> He says you should also have a good sense of humor. I I believe in that. I make otherwise we'll get bored. Humor is very very important today we talk about in every hospital we should have a humor department. If a doctor is coming out patient will think my if a doctor comes from the OT operation theater and if he comes like that people will think my patient is gone. and if you come smiling this is my patient is all right the humor is very important anything else you want to add well I, i think that relates to the larger themes of what we've talked about today if you have a good sense of humor you are not taking yourself too seriously and if you're not taking yourself too seriously you realize that you are part of a much larger scheme of life uh, you're 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 not the center of the world you're part of a much larger uh, environment um, exactly. and therefore your social consciousness is probably greater also thank you uh, we'll take one or two comments yes dr yadav please Just join uh, one one line. I'll I'll require four five people to speak one line each. If somebody wants to make a comment, the other one line means one line. I know that. Dhai line. Okay. Dhai akshar prem ke. Dhai akshar. Dhai akshar. One line se bhi kam ho jayega. मैं सुनने के बाद महसूस कर रहा हूँ कि मानवता का धर्म सबसे उच्च धर्म है. बस उदाय वो कुटुम कम. हमारे ऋषि मुनि ने कहा है कि वसुधैव कुटुम्बकम पूरा संसार ही हमारा परिवार है उसके बारे में एक चार दो लाइनों का शेर रस्मे तकल्लुफ रस्मे तकल्लुफ निभाते रहिए रस्मे तकल्लुफ फॉर्मेलिटीज निभाते रहिए अजनबी शहर है दोस्त बनाते रहिए रस्मे तकल्लुफ निभाते रहिए अजनबी शहर है दोस्त बनाते रहिए दुश्मनी लाख हो खत्म न कीजिए रिश्ते दुश्मनी लाख हो खत्म न कीजिए रिश्ते दिल मिले ना मिले हाथ मिलाते रहिए दिल मिले ना मिले हाथ मिलाते रहिए हाथ मिलाते रहिए नहीं हाथ बजाते रहिए ताली बजाइए इनके लिए थैंक यू आई विल हैव टू मोर यस अनुपमा सुरेश कपूर मैं ये पूछना चाहता हूँ आपने इतनी डिस्कशन की किसी ने भी ये कहा कि मीट या मच्छी या जो नान वे नहीं खाना चाहिए मैं लोगों से पूछा जाता हूँ बहुत yeah, अच्छा वेरी गुड वेरी गुड क्वेश्चन क्या आपने मीठ है मच्छी के बारे में अभी कि हेल्थ अच्छी रखनी है तो मीठ अभी अभी, अच्छी अभी मैंने जब ये जब ये बातचीत इन्होंने सवाल उठाया ही है अभी मैं अशोक जी से बात कर रहा था कि हमारा नेक्स्ट टॉपिक क्या होना चाहिए एंड इस नेक्स्ट मंथ वेन बी मीट अवर नेक्स्ट टॉपिक विद ऑल द रिलीजियस लीडर्स विल बी डाइट इस डाइट ओबेसिटी और अल्पहार के बारे में सब लोगों ने बात करी आई थिंक वी मस्ट कम आउट विद ऑल रिलीजन कंसेंस ऑन डाइट वी विल हैव डैट एज ए नेक्स्ट सेशन वी आर नॉट आंसरिंग दिस टूडे बिकॉज फिर अगली बार आप आओगे नहीं ये अनुपमा दैट्स द लास्ट स्टेटमेंट फॉर अनुपमा
सुधार जी कुछ कहना चाह रहे थे कभी बचपन में पढ़े थे मैं बोलना चाहूंगी यसे रागा दिना न मनो दूषितम मंदिरे तेन पूजा कृता वाना वा येन माता पिता से व्या पूजित हो तेन काशी अयोध्या गता वाना वा यानी कहने का मतलब ये है कि जिसका मन और बुद्धि शुद्ध है वो मंदिर में जाए या ना जाए वो एक ही बात है और जिसने माता पिता की सेवा कर ली वो उसको तीर्थ यात्रा की कोई जरूरत नहीं है और ये सभी धर्मों का का जोड़ यही है अपने माता पिता की सेवा कीजिए अपना मन शुद्ध रखे ना आपको बीमारी होगी ना कोई समस्या थैंक यू बोला चाहते कुछ इज अ लास्ट वन टू इज अ लास्ट वर्ड देन आई एम गोइंग टू सम Dr. Jasbir Singh. Dr. Uh, Jasbir Singh uh, is a very senior ENT surgeon in the city of Delhi. The summary of Sikh about this topic, health and happiness, Sikh scriptures has got. I will say only two lines by Guru Gobind Singh Ji. Alp ahar sulapsi nindra daya chima tan preet. You see, these are the virtues. Alp ahar sulapsi nindra daya chima tan preet. seal santok you see this is all is uh, control on yourself seal santok sada nirba bahbo hoye go bisan parit one sentence for health and happiness is this and second what about the meditation gurbani says clarifies each and everything karishnan simar prab apna man tan bhay aroga this is the uh, <coughs> दिस आर जस्ट ऑफ एवरीथिंग कारिश्नान सिमर प्रभ अपना मंथन भय अरोगा सेकेंड सेंट लाइन आई एम जस्ट फॉर गेटिंग नाउ बट दिस इज द जस्ट ऑफ एवरी रिलीजन एंड दिस इज द जस्ट ऑफ द सिख रिलीजन ऑल्सो इफ यू मेडिटेट इफ यू कंट्रोल ऑन योर सेल्फ एंड इफ यू टेक ए बैलेंस्ड लाइफ दैट इज द रियली द वे टू health and happiness both thank, thank you. you thank you i'll tell you what i practice i what i tell you i'll practice my practice is that when i teach my my patients i teach them that every monday i teach them exercise everything diet everything and i teach them on monday please follow don't criticize don't condemn don't don't complain on tuesday i tell them confess confess and confess and then talk to your people to whom you don't like and try to make friends with them on wednesday i tell them to tell everybody love compassion mercy and i said give them a non materialistic gift appreciate people on wednesday give them a gift of smile every day enjoy the nature on thursday i tell them to think differently instead of saying you are 60 year old say i am 20 year old with 40 years of experience think differently and on friday i said always talk about the food and learn everything about food and on saturday i teach them the path of satya and i teach them offer help to everybody may i help you how can i help somebody but and that's the gist of all religions but i also tell them ki main sadhuon se kabhi kabhi alap bhi kar leta hu main sadhuon se kabhi kabhi alap bhi kar leta hu mandir mein ja ke puja paath bhi kar leta hu yahi soch kar ki main aadmi se khuda na ban jaau main kabhi kabhi paap bhi kar leta hu so sunday is a cheating day so when you are following all religions follow them in moderation not as a kattarwadi and and follow them in moderation kabhi kabhi cheating chalti hai uske liye hum log baithe hain agar us cheating se aapko koi nuksan hota hai to hum aapko bimar nahi hone denge and that's all i think we should give a big hand to all our speakers to all our religions this is a, a maiden attempt of my left and my right my gurus both of them are scholars and they 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 brought this idea why not join hand with health with bhatia vidya bhavan bhatia vidya bhavan has been talking about spirituality all their life but this is the first time a health with a stethoscope is sitting in between to bring spirituality into health the concept of spiritual medicine we'll meet again we will have one more session next month we will come back with all religious leaders on a consensus on diet so that obesity menace can be reduced i'm going to end and before that i will have a, a momentos to all our speakers please uh, stay for 5 minutes till we give momentos to everybody i always end with my formula of 80 mera ek formula hai ki agar aap chahte hain ki 80 saal tak aapko koi bimari na ho 
अगर आपको 80 साल तक आपको कोई हार्ट की या लाइफस्टाइल की बीमारी ना हो तो क्या करें दिल की धड़कन नीचे का ब्लड प्रेशर गंदे कोलेस्ट्रॉल की मात्रा फास्टिंग शुगर और पेट की चौड़ाई सबको अस्सी से कम रखें इसके लिए अस्सी मिनट रोज चले एक हफ्ते में अस्सी मिनट तेज चले एक मिनट में अस्सी कदम चले खाना कम खाएं एक बार में 80 ग्राम से खाना ना खाएं ज्यादा कैलोरी फूड एक बार में 80 एम से ज्यादा कैलोरी लिक्विड ना लें ऐसे एटमोसफियर में ना बैठे जहां 80 डेसिबल से ज्यादा एटमोसफियर एक पोल्यूशन हो नॉइस पोल्यूशन हो साल में 80 दिन अनाज ना खाएं दिन भर में 80 मिनट अपने आप को दें अस्सी बार हंसे मुस्कुराए अस्सी प्राणायाम करें और अगर आप चाहते हो कि अस्सी साल तक आपको हार्ट अटैक ना हो मेरे ये नाइन रिलीजन और मेरे ये दो सहपाठी भारतीय विद्या भवन के लिए 80 बार तालियां बजाएं।